After the Indian Navy executed a daring rescue operation in the Arabian Sea saving 23 Pakistani nationals from Somali pirates, the rescued Pakistani crew expressed their gratitude towards India. Indian Navy ka shukriya. India Zindabad. Maldives president has alleged that the former Maldives president was operating on orders from a foreign ambassador, however, he did not specify which foreign country he was referring to. Hindustan Shipyard Limited has signed a major infrastructure upgradation contract with LNTGO structure with a project completion timeline of 20 months, that will boost its capacity for ongoing five fleet support ships and future projects like landing platform dock. The DRDO has identified Indian industry partners for the manufacturing of Manik small turbofan engine components major systems and line replaceable units, and as lead integrator for the engine. The RDO is currently developing a prototype of surface wave over the horizon radar that will have a range of 500 kilometers that would be followed by a sky wave over the horizon radar with a detection range of over 2000 kilometers. A Pakistani analyst has said that even if India opts for the minimum configuration of four MIRVED warheads per missile and scales up the numbers of its land-based and submarine launched missiles, it will have profound implications in the region. The Korean KF-21 fighter program relies heavily on American origin technology, with significant contributions from companies like Raytheon and Northrop Grumman. South Korean authorities are also investigating one of the 15 Indonesian engineers working on the KF-21 joint development project on suspicion that he stole critical technologies. Industry sources have said that India's AMCA program has embraced self-reliance from its inception, minimizing the risk of espionage, and ensuring control over critical technologies. Military experts have said that Pakistan Air Force is rapidly adding the 145 km range Chinese PL-15E missile on its JF-17 and J-10CE fighter jets, while on the other hand, the limited order of only 250 units of 110 km range Astra Mark 1 missiles is insufficient for the sizable feat of over 260 Su-30 fighter jets of the Indian Air Force, and both 160 km range Astra Mark 2 II and 350 km Astra Mark 3 is still under development, and faces a time lag before deployment and the situation might worsen with the availability of export variant of the Chinese PL-17, that boasts an extended range of over 250 km. UAE's Edge Group has started discussions with Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, for the joint development of an India-specific variant of its Reach S medium altitude long endurance drone. It can carry a payload of up to 120 kg can fly at an altitude of 22,000 feet, has an impressive endurance of 24 hours, and has a cruising speed of 150 km per hour. It offers a communications range of 200 km, making it suitable for intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance missions, as well as precision ground attack. The DRDO has unveiled an advanced hydro gas suspension unit for the Arjun Mark 1A main battle tank, that marks a significant upgrade from the existing hydro pneumatic suspension unit used in the Arjun Mark 1 tank. It offers enhanced off road mobility and superior high speed cross country maneuverability, and also ensures a more stable firing platform even when the tank is on the move. Today's top 3 comments.